Hello and welcome back to A Quaint Life. Today is a busy day starting off at the horse ranch for my daughter's riding lessons. We come here about once a week and during the summer the lessons have to be scheduled pretty early in the morning because it gets so hot here. With such an early riding lesson, we skipped breakfast and are now having a brunch style lunch. I am making a spinach frittata which I will leave the link for the recipe from the blog for you below. Every day there is something that needs cleaning aside from the kitchen stuff like dishes and things like that. Today it's the floors that I'm going to focus on. They need to be both vacuumed in some areas and then mopped in others. Cleaning the floors tends to take me quite a while since most of our house is wood floors. I not only have to sweep and mop those, but I need to clean the rugs that are in the rooms as well. So it's a process that I reserve for days that I can spend a couple of hours on it. With fall just around the corner, I'm wanting to make a few beeswax candles. They are my favorite type of candle to burn, and today I'm making a votive style candle with a little essential oil for scent. These are very simple to make and actually clean the air in the areas which they're burned. For these, you can use any type of glass container you'd like, and today I have a few odd ones that I just found around the house to use. I decided to add a little grapefruit essential oil in, but even if you don't add essential oil, I like the earthy scent of the beeswax when it burns, so it's definitely not necessary. And of course, if you'd like to learn how to make beeswax candles, make sure to look at the description box below because I have all the links from the blog directly there. You probably realize by now that I'm obsessed with flowers, and on the way home from the writing lessons, I stopped off for some flowers for the table. I grabbed these beautiful orange roses, and I'm going to make two bouquets out of them, one for the living room and one for the dining room.
flowers bring so much life to a space and I really like having them in the seating areas of our home. For dinner tonight I'm making salmon salads. This is just a standard salad I make for days when I'm really not in the mood to cook. It takes just a few minutes to put together and I like having these individual salmon fillets on hand for quick meals. much for joining me today. I really do hope you enjoy your time here with me and that it inspires you in your homemaking and in your day. Have a great week ahead and I will see you in the next one.